What's up guys, my name is Alex Costa and you guys are always asking me, Alex, how do you do your hair? How do you style it? What is your technique? What kind of products do you use? So today I'm giving you step by step how I style my hair every single day and everything that I do it, everything that I use, okay? All right, so first things first, as you can see, my hair is damp, it's wet, there's nothing in it. It is clean. It's very important that you start with a clean uh, set of hair just because you know you don't want any product build up in there. You don't want anything like that, any oil. So you wash it with shampoo, condition it. And then when you get out of the shower, my first tip to you guys is do not aggressively uh, towel dry. You have to pat dry your hair because it is very fragile when it's wet. So you're gonna cause breakage if you're too aggressive with it. So just do this, get the excess water out to make sure that it's good. There we go. All right, now it is semi-dry. As you can see, it is, it's damp, not like soaked. You know, that's, that's the goal here, to have it just damp. And what I'm gonna do first is, I'm gonna apply some oil to my hair. This is the Forte Series Argan Oil that is coming out in just a couple of months, I think. Um, don't quote me on that, it's coming out soon. And what this is gonna do is, it's going to hydrate my hair. And you can use any Argan Oil while th this one doesn't come out. Um, it's gonna soften my hair, it's gonna make it nice and smooth, and most importantly, it's gonna protect my hair against any type of um, heat. So we're gonna be using a blow dryer today, and it's really important to protect your hair from that. So just apply it in there. there you go, make sure you mix it in. And now my hair is nice, it's soft, and most importantly, it is protected. Next up, we're gonna be using a blow dryer. If you do not use a blow dryer right now and you're trying to achieve my hairstyle, I'm sorry to tell you that it's gonna be, it's gonna be very difficult, okay? So you need a blow dryer. And um, I'm gonna show you exactly how I do it right now. I'm gonna use a round brush. This one has the bores here, so it's not, it's not dirty. Some people are like, why is it so dirty? It's actually extremely clean. It's just how it is. These like bristles here actually make it shinier. It's a really good hairbrush. I'll link it in the description below if you're trying to get that very similar or the same hairbrush. All right, let's get started here. What I first like to do is I brush it back just a little bit like this, just to get any like clumps of hair, hair or like any knots or anything like that out. Boom. There we go. As you can see, it's kind of like a, I got like a slick back going right now. And then what you do is you Put the brush on your hair and you pull it up and dry that as you're going up. Okay, and what that does is it straightens out and smooths your hair. Okay, I have some, um, some curls, some, some waves, and to get that out, I do need to kind of pull pretty hard, not too hard to a point where it hurts, but you wanna pull the skin and you can actually see the skin being pulled up right here as I pull my hair up as well. And then you dry it into place, I go highest heat, highest velocity or speed here on the air all the way through. Let's get started. The secret here is to make sure that your hair dries into your desired shape. So if you wanna get rid of any waves or curls, for example, you're gonna to have to pull your hair pretty hard with that brush and straighten it out. If you want more volume, you wanna blow dry it up to make it somewhat stand up on your head. All of that while brushing it in the actual direction that you want your hair to end up in. I actually like to blow dry my sides down here too so that my hair doesn't get too puffy or stick. it doesn't stick out. I hate when my sides stick out. It looks like you're in need of a haircut, so I just do this right here. Now for the pro tips. If you want super crazy volume, this is what you do. Whatever side you usually part your hair to, blow dry it to the opposite side for a while. Then you flip the hair dryer over and you blow dry it to the actual side that you want it to end up in. That's gonna give you instant volume and instant height. Then to finish it off, you're gonna heat up your hair with the highest heat setting right here, in the direction that you want it to end up in, then blast it with cold air. The cold air is gonna lock your hair into place and then you're done. All right, now that my hair is dry, you can see that it already has some shape and that's because when you put the argan oil and then you blow dry it into place and make sure that it's good, then it pretty much stays like this, right? And what you wanna do is you wanna keep it like that, but without any product, it's just gonna flop over, as you can see. We're gonna use some Forte Series Texture Clay. This is my new clay that just came out. As you guys know, we've already received thousands of orders, so First of all, thank you guys so much for the support. It's been incredible. It's been amazing to just see these orders coming in, uh, to see the tweets, to see the Instagram posts and stories. Um, I really appreciate it. It means the world to me. So thank you guys so much. Uh, this is a very heavy clay, and I'm gonna show you guys 
uh, what I mean by that. So as you can see, it's kind of hard to scoop. It's a pretty hard product. So you have to really dig in there. So when you get this product, when you get it delivered, don't think, oh, I can't even dig in. It's really hard. It's frozen, whatever. No, you just have to really dig in. If for whatever reason you feel like it's a little too hard to dig in, if you live in a cold area uh, and you, you know it was in a truck city and the truck outside and it's frozen or whatever, you can always heat it up like this. Done, that's all you need, heat it up a little bit. It's easier to scoop that way. And you scoop out just about this much. It's about a dime, don't really need that much. My hair is somewhat long right now and this is all I'm gonna use. And always remember guys, you can use more if you want. You know, you use this much at first. If for some reason you feel like you need more product, you can always apply more, you can never take away. So if you put too much product, you're gonna have to wash your hair again and start over. We don't want that, we ain't got time for that. So. Put that on your palm. And this is one of the most important things that you have to do right now. So listen carefully. You have to break it down all the way. You don't want to leave any clumps. So you put it on your palm and you really smush it in there together. And you see how, if you look at my hands right now, there are a few clumps. You don't want that because that's going to clump right into your hair. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that you smooth it out all the way. So use those muscles that you got, all right? Until it is absolutely clear. So when you look at it now, it's like this clear, thin layer of product on my palms. And that's exactly what you want. And for extra precaution, what I would tell you to do is start back here. So if there's any clumps at all, then it's gonna, it's gonna be in the back of your hair and not right in the front where everyone can see it. So you start in the back and then you work your way towards the front and you can really work it in there. Make sure you get the roots as well because that's what's gonna keep your hair up. Get the roots. It's kind of hard not doing this without a mirror. I'm kind of like using a monitor that's really far away, so I apologize. But I mean, look at the hold on this thing. I haven't even done it. Look at the hold on this ring. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Like if I really wanted to, like, look at that. It's insane. The hold on this is amazing. That's why it's a little bit harder of a clay. But if you know how to work it, if you really work it into your palms, and I still have so much product. I actually overuse a little bit because I just cut my hair. So I have less hair and more product. So you can just, Style it. What I like to do is I like to bring down the sides like this so it's a nice classy look. I make sure that it's good here. On the back, what I like to do is I just kind of bring my hands together here like that. I really don't need that much product in the back. And then in the front, I do this on the sides here. And in the front, what I like to do is I like to use my fingers to create texture, to create like these little spaces of hair like that. So texture just looks so good in hair. You don't want it to be all clumped up. So you see how it creates these little holes right here in my hairstyle? That's exactly what you want. That's how this is created, just using my fingers. You just do this, boom, and it locks it in. That's why this is called the texture clay because it will give you this much texture just by using your fingers, which is awesome. So you can see that there's texture, you can see all the lines, it looks really good. There's depth you know, to the hairstyle, which is awesome. And it's easy to wash out. I don't have any water on me, but you can literally just, just wash it out with water and soap. And on your hair, you can just use shampoo and it comes off very easily. We made sure of that. Also, this product is infused with argan oil. So it is actually nourishing my hair right now as it holds it together. This is so easy to use, guys. If you want, if you have a hairstyle, they really want to keep it together. If you want some hairspray, you can do that. If you want some texture powder, you can add that as well. But reality is, the, the hold on this thing is ridiculous. Like it's gonna hold your hair together all day long. And one of the best things about this product too is you can move it around. So yes, it is a hard clay, but if I wanna change my hairstyle right now, I can't, it will work. Look, if I just want, for example, sometimes I do this cause I think it looks kind of cool. So like, just get a little bit messy. You know what I mean? Boom, look at that. It holds it in place. So it looks cool, it looks, kind of like a careless vibe, you know, beach vibe. Like, this looks amazing, but it's held together. It's not like flapping around. Look, it's not moving, but it's also soft. And if I want to bring it back, I can just do that. And all of a sudden, my hairstyle is back to, to what it was before. So this is why I'm saying this hair product is incredible. Like, I, I worked on this for two years. I'm so excited with it. And, you know, we got the argan oil coming out soon. We have other products coming out soon, and I'm so stoked. I would love to know what you guys think of this hairstyle and of this hairstyle tutorial. If you guys have any questions at all, 
I'm gonna be very diligent and answer as many questions in the comments as possible. I know everybody's hair is different. I know everybody's hair type is different, hair length, you know, so uh, hairline. So if you have any questions about your specific body, your specific hair, let me know in the comment section down below and I'll try my best to help you guys. This is how I do my hair. It takes no more than 10 minutes, like no more than 10 minutes to do my hair every single day. I try to be quick. I'm not sitting there like, trying all these different things. The haircut is important, of course, that's the base of any hairstyle. And of course, the products will do a whole lot for you here. If you guys wanna order Forte Series Texture Clay, it is out right now. It's forteseries.com. It's gonna be listed in the description below. And again, I just wanna thank you guys. It's been amazing. I actually included a thank you letter in every single product. So if you're gonna order it, you're gonna get a special letter from me that I hand wrote um, just for you guys. So. I really appreciate it guys, you guys have been amazing and this launch has been nothing short of uh, special to me. So thank you so much. If you guys want any other hair product, hair, hair tutorials, uh, I'm gonna list a few of them in the description below as well as some haircuts. We just did a live haircut, no edits, fully live, the full haircut with Robert and how I style my hair. It's on my YouTube channel, I'll link that in the description below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again very soon. Peace.